I don't know. What is it? What is it? What am I having? What am I having? Are you pregnant? Are you writing you're pregnant? Oh my god. Are you writing you're pregnant? <laughs> Welcome back, Latte. Welcome back to Ladies and Lattes. Today, I'm going to surprise Holly with the gender of our baby. No, you're not. I'm not. No, I'm Gosh, not. Gosh dang it, Jess. <laughs> the second she got here, she's like, wait, is this actually going to be surprise? Real gender reveal? reveal the gender? No. Are you lying to me? I'm not lying. I don't know yet. But we we'll figure it out. Gonna do this. Old wives' tales. Gender mm. prediction test. Before we get to bussin' wives' tales, what do you think that you're gonna have? I think you're gonna have a girl. She's set on me having a girl. Or you're gonna have a little devil boy. Well, which one? Little... Which one? <laughs> Tell me which you're one. You're gonna have please. another angel baby girl, oh, or you're gonna have a boy awesome. who's a holy terror, and you're just gonna never want kids. So at first, I was kind of thinking it was a girl more so because I thought I wanted a girl. But the more I think about like the possibilities of each, the more I'm like. Eh, Maybe I want this, maybe you want this. Remember? But I think it's a boy. But I thought it was a boy last time too. I know, and I was gonna say, remember how sad you were when you thought oh my you gosh. were having a boy? They told me it was a boy, and then a month later they told me, just kidding, it's a girl. So I was totally like emotionally flip flop. Well, let's find out. Let's see. I wanna, let's do I wanna know. Okay, um, okay, some people swear by these. I think that they don't mean a thing, but they're still really fun to do. Maybe However, maybe. the ring test, this one, well, maybe. Legit, because it was right for me last time, and apparently it's right for a lot of people. We'll have to see. And then you guys thought that you were done seeing us play with P, but you just wait. We are gonna play with P again on this oh, channel. Oh no! Oh, at least it's not my P. You can tell Jess is a graphic designer because everything is in a straight line. All right, so carrying high or low. Because what defines carrying high or low? Like, where is your belly button supposed to be? I don't know. It's right there. So here's the thing. I think. I'm carrying higher than I am low because I feel like low would be like way down here. High means girl, low means boy. Girl check mark. Okay, so next, the Mayan calendar Mayan test. Calendar. So it's based off of age and the year of conception. If both of the numbers are even or both of the numbers are odd, that means you're having a girl, but if you've got one even, one odd. So you're gonna have a boy. boy. Um, this is 2019. 20. And you're 30. You're Wait, I'm 29. Oh. So those Wait. are both odd. So that means I'd be having a girl. 29? Uh-huh. Probably 30 in February. I'm the young, youthful one in this. Why do you keep saying you're 30? In all the videos, I'm like, I'm 30, and you're all, yeah, and you're not even I'm 30 close yet. enough. I mean, is 30 really gonna hit me that hard? Yeah, my body really? feels really old now. Oh, no. Um, Softer dry hands. Well, this test, I certainly would never be able to do for myself <laughs> because I always have dry hands. That's so. funny because normally, like, it feels normally, soft to me. Well, I just put some lotion on because my hands have been extra dry lately. My whole body's been really you, dry. You have to be the judge of this one. Dry hands. So, boy. Boy. Size of breasts. Again, so, you have to be the judge. Which one? <laughs> they say that. Or Austin. I'll, I'll be the judge. They say that if your boobs grow, like, a lot, you're having a girl if they just maybe get a little bit bigger or don't change. Did you boobs boy. grow a lot? They didn't. See, big thumbs down from oh. my husband. Do you remember when I was pregnant with Micah? Yeah, they were huge. They got huge so quick. <laughs> okay, oh. so boy, All right? Yeah, this was a big difference from my last pregnancy. Leg hair growth. They say that if your leg hair grows faster, it's a boy. If it grows slower or not much change, it's a girl. And my hair, has pretty much stopped growing on my legs. I haven't had really? to shave much at all. It's been great. <laughs> I haven't shaved in like wow over a week. It feels like you got laser, right? And the hair grows everywhere else, but on the your hair? legs. Yeah, so we can skip down to oh, this hair, hair test, test if you want. So if your hair grows like if it looks full and thick and shiny, means you're having a boy. If it looks dull and flat, means you're having a girl. So what do you think? I mean, compared to, I think, what normally your hair looks like, I would say it's dull. Really? Yeah. Because I think the opposite. Because really? it's been growing fast. Because I got a haircut recently. I think it looks more dull than normal. Well, then check it for... What do you think, Austin? Today, it does look a little flat. Oh, well then, flat it is. I'm having a girl. Yes. Let's do the ring test. What's the for ring this test? this one, you need my wedding ring. Okay. And a strand of my hair. Let me pull out a nice and long one for you. I'm like, we're getting into okay. witchcraft. So, Tie it on the very end of that. Yeah, like, so that you have a string to dangle it with. <laughs> if the ring swings in a circle, the baby will be a girl. If it swings back and forth, the baby's a boy. So I'm gonna lay down on the couch. Hold it right over my belly button. Be as still as you can. 
You're really still. I'm trying to be very still. This one is really accurate for a lot of people. I think it's going back and forth. Yeah, it's definitely going more back and forth. Oh boy! This one has the most legitimacy in my Let's head try this for some reason. Time. Are you gonna make it through the circle? <laughs> no! I want you to have a boy so that you have a boy. <laughs> that is definitely back and forth. That is, yeah, very much back and forth. I am so still right now. Look at my hand. I know, it's so still. You are a professional ring tester. Boy, it is! Boy it is. <gasps> oh my god! Craving. So they say if you're craving sweet foods, to grow if you're craving salty or sour, it's a boy. This is sweet. hard because I've been a little bit of both, but I think more so sweet. I've been having more sweet cravings than yep. normal. Face weight gain. Does my face look chubbier than normal? I feel like it does. Let me see. Maybe it's just your lady beard. Maybe it's my lady beard that I haven't trimmed in a few weeks. Husband, you can be the judge. No. Big face. Really? You don't think so? Mm -mm. Yeah. I guess not. Yes girl, no boy. So, no means boy. Uh oh. This is not good. That is pretty even. You're having twins! Oh my god. <laughs> I did have a dream that I was having triplets. Are you sure there's not boy. two babies in there? We just looked at the doctor. Is this all a ploy and to he told surprise us no. you with your twins? I'm gonna be so mad at you. Don't oh, look at me like that! that. She's giving me that. Well, I have a secret. No, there's not twins. Okay. Sympathy waking. Does he look any bigger to you? Let's, Let's see, see that belly. That you are. I think. Yeah, yeah last gone. time. Last time he gained a little bit, but this time I don't think he's. So is like no anything. weight gain a boy? Yep, no weight gain means boy. Good. If you have a boy, can I help pick his name? I mean, maybe. <laughs> Give us some, some suggestions. Ah! Can I just like help anyway, even if it's a girl? Yeah. You can help. <laughs> that was not very convincing, yeah. I mean, it depends on what names you pick, really. If I really like it, then yeah, you can help. All right, so Next one skull is theory. skull theory. This one's supposed to be like kind of actually scientific. So you're supposed to look at the baby's um, ultrasound photos. If the skull has a lower rounded jaw and a top head that kind of tapers more, it's supposed to be a girl. And a boy has a more sloping forehead and squared jaw. So it kind of like, if you think about big differences between the male and woman head and skull, I like, it makes see. sense. But I have such a hard time How do you telling. even tell? I don't know. I see a penis. Where, where do you see it? See that little dot? Right here? That's a little penis right there. That black dot? It's a boy! <laughs> I mean... I know I how to read an ultrasound. I did look at what the ultrasound What is this? Stuff Are these the legs? Yeah, that's a leg. And this is a big Looks belly. Looks like a little that's alien. A look at the big belly! <laughs> I know, it's like a mica big belly. Is this the brain? This I mean, round... I think that might be. I don't really know. Holly, you I gotta... like how you immediately went from, I know how to read an ultrasound, that's a penis too. Is that a leg? <laughs> Shut up, Austin. <laughs> you got a little demigorgon in here. <laughs> I know, I got my little daughter demigorgon in my... Oh, no. In here. What are you thinking? This is the forehead, right? Yeah. That's boy. Are you thinking all the way? Boy? Yeah. You think? Look, it's not round at all. Well, is this where the eyes will be eventually when it's not an alien? Um. Is that like eyes, nose, mouth? Kind of. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I guess then it like, would be round. It's hard to say. I'm gonna let you decide. I don't know. I'm convinced I see a little penis, it's so I'm gonna say boy. <laughs> what do you guys think? What do you see as far as skull theory goes? This one's so hard for us. Okay, swollen legs and ankles. No. Do you have cankles? No, I think they're pretty normal. I mean, yeah. I have put on a little weight, mm -hmm. but. No, you haven't. Definitely I have. not. So is I've no I've put on weight? almost 10 pounds. It's all right here. Pretty much. In your yeah. placenta. Pretty much. No swelling means girl. Really? Yeah. That blows my mind. No swelling means girl. Okay. So sleep position. If you sleep on your right side, it's a girl. If you sleep on your left side, it's a boy. I more often than not sleep on my right side. While you're pregnant. Yeah. Well, like right is girl. Yeah. What about right memory is loss? Is that a thing? That is a big thing. And right. I am girl. suffering from that. <laughs> Graceful or clumsy? Graceful means girl. Clumsy means boy. And I feel like I have been clumsier than normal. Really? Like I'll find myself knocking things over or dropping things more. But my husband's looking Not at true. me like, no. I haven't seen you clumsy at all. I've done things. Where I'm just like, oh my gosh, what am huh. I doing? Are you just paying attention to it more? I don't feel like... No, because I didn't know this was even a 
a thing until she looked it up until i looked it up yeah i feel like i've been clumsier mood test i have definitely been moodier that is a girl okay and my husband <laughs> is shaking his head were you moody when austin told jay you bought a bunch of post malone concert tickets no i wasn't he spent like 500 dollars on concert tickets. apply for a new credit card only only half of that now i gotta go pee in a cup okay last two tests I'll wait. These ones are I'll very wait scientific too. Yeah, obviously. I don't believe these ones. I'm really glad that I don't have to pee in a cup this time. Okay, pee coming through. Don't judge. Why is it's, it so cloudy? I don't know. Let's cloudy see. Cloudy pee. Cloudy pee. Is that a I really, I think that's part of it. Light and dull means girl. Bright yellow means boy. Light and dull. Light and dull. Girl. But not that's, as light that's as that's I. That's not on our thing. could be a little more hydrated. Don't okay. worry, guys. She's still drinking plenty means, of water. <laughs> she's <laughs> healthy. Healthy. Look at my pea color, everybody. All right, baking soda. If it fizzes, it's a boy. If it doesn't fizz, girl. Gosh, I hope I don't splash. I think I smell your pee. <laughs> Mine. No, it didn't fizz. I don't What's see no fizz? fizzing. No fizz means girl. Yep, I don't see any fizzing. I mean, uh, at I first mean. it was like sort of bubbling, but I think that was just from you pouring it pouring in. Pouring it in, yeah. Okay, let me count this up. <gasps> the grand yeah, total. One, two. Oh, I'm so intrigued. What do you think? I really don't know. Like, it looked pretty even to me, and I didn't bother counting. I don't know. What is it? What is it? What am I having? What am I having? Are you pregnant? Are you writing you're pregnant? Oh my gosh. Are you writing you're pregnant? <laughs> no. What? Yeah. down from that adrenaline spike. Well, <laughs> I'm really gonna have to get creative when I do announce my pregnancy to you because you're expecting it now. I'm expecting it. Well, I know I can't that, get pregnant now for like two years might because- be trying, maybe. I'm not, though. All right, guys, what do you think <sighs> I'm having? Put it in the comments below. Let girl. me know if you were able to tell based on that skull theory or any of the things. I don't know, who could tell on that? You yeah, that might alien, not be Alien, baby, that's all that tells me. I don't know if that's enough of a profile to tell, but mm. if you guys have any other pregnancy-related videos that you want us to do throughout this pregnancy, let us know. Put them in the comments. We will be doing some cravings and we will be having Holly wear a pregnancy belly. When Jess is huge, we'll do that. Yeah, that'll be down the road, but if you have any other ideas, let us know. Having a girl. <sighs> Baby spot my number two. I told Jess when I have a kid that I'm just gonna give it to them to raise because <laughs> Micah's so cute and nice. <laughs> She's so She's sweet. She's so nice. I'm like, here you go. I will birth it, you raise She's it. She's pretty much the best, yeah. <laughs> She's yeah. awesome. We love you, baby spummer, too. You'll catch up. Love you, too. <laughs> You'll catch up in our hearts. Um, All right, thanks guys. for watching. Hit that subscribe button. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye, lattes.